Hi, welcome to today's demo of BOC LIC, L-I-C-C. That stands for Link Integration for Cisco Call Manager. What LIC does is it allows you to inject the Cisco CUCM call status into the existing Microsoft Link presence structure that your organization would have, essentially combining the two together. What I've got on the screen today is two programs. On the right, you see Microsoft Link 2013. On the left, you'll see something called Bridge Executive Console. This is the slimmed down version of our Bridge Operator Console, and I've just got it here so we can kind of control this phone that we're going to be using and see the status of the person's calls as well. Uh, for this particular one, um, we're going to use Melissa Went on both sides, and her primary extension is 7601. So I'm actually going to be controlling her phone here, which looks like a, um, you know, like this. It's a Cisco 7965 uh, color hard phone. So, so that's the phone I'm going to be um, controlling with our program BEC, and that'll be the one that's tied to her Microsoft Link account as well. So, so what happens when a call is answered and someone goes off hook on the Cisco side of things. Um, in that case, when we get a call here and we answer it, you'll see the link status gets set to on a call, and in this case we're providing the caller ID. This is an option you can turn on. By default it won't. It will just say, you know, I'm on a call, and it won't say any other details. But you can also enable, uh, you know, caller ID visibility if you want as well. And that'll work for all the users. And as you saw, it's pretty much instantaneous. So if someone else gets a call, say Doug Johnson here, um, we'll be able to see that that person's on, on a call as well. And even if we, you know, expand his contact card out, we can see, you know, all that information there as well too. So it really flows nicely with Microsoft Link. So what happens when a person hangs up that call? You see they go back to their original status. Uh, and I'll do the same here. As we jettison Melissa's call, you see she went right back to the available status that she was. So. Um, some features of BOC LIC. Uh, it's server-based, so you don't need to s install it on 2,500 workstations in order for it to work. You don't have to have the person logged in to Microsoft Link for it to work, or their machine running, or anything like that. Um, since it's server-based, it's just a single install on a Link Trusted App Server. And in many cases, that can be the same server that the BOC Tappy Connector or the Tox to Call Manager can reside on. So. Um, really, it's not going to add any additional hardware requirements for your organization either. Um, there is no, like I said, client plugins or anything that's going to mess with the existing Microsoft Link menu structure like Cookie Link does. Uh, that is not at all required. Um, the server component will keep itself updated too, so as there's patches, it will always maintain the latest version for you. Uh, and like I mentioned before, you have the option to show the caller ID information, or you can just leave it as the generic on a call indicator. And it'll work with all versions of Link, and it'll work with versions of Call Manager from 6 through 10. Um, if you have any questions about BOC Link, please reach out to our sales team at sales at bridgeoc.com, or you can give them a call at area code 701-212-4797. Thank you.